Framework one. Framework one is God, space, and time. It will start with everything. This framework one is five addition point is there, and uh, you can say every addition point almost ten idea unit will be there, and every idea unit minimum we will able to learn ten to twelve vocabulary. Then easily from one framework you will able to learn around five hundred vocabulary, minimum direct vocabulary. Indirect again multiple. that uh, you can say pdf list or this afterwards once uh, session you will finish all the vocabulary you can go for that then uh, framework one addition one this god space and time five addition we have break down addition one is before god and universe now just will focus on this point before god and this will be like a logical sequence nothing nothing means silence nothing and silence god the almighty has come he has created the universe after universe we will understand about the solar system our solar system we are not worried about the parosika solar system our solar system afterwards in our solar our solar, uh, solar system we are living on the earth this beautiful blue planet this is called blue planet milton has written very good poem related to earth they are moving slowly slowly but it is the best planet in our solar system this is the living planet everything can we live here everything can be grow here not uh, not other planets are there in our solar system which are having that much capacity or that much uh, that much capability or in any of the sense then this is blue planet slow moving planet and fertile for everything then from solar system will come to the earth and once will come to the earth then we'll learn about this atmosphere environment on the earth surface different type of creatures living non living there after that five elements are there that combinedly will give the life we know five element everybody aware then uh, that five element we will learn life will come about the life we will understand and in life we will focus on the human being because everything is created by us whatever understanding we gain about the earth or about the sun whatever little bit tiny information that we have done during last thousand thousand years of you can say hard struggle or hard inventions many of the things many of the people has sacrificed their life then it will be like a logical flow then it will give it one kind of narrative to understand the vocabulary and that narrative once frame has fixed in your brain it will be easy throughout your life then nothing in silence this addition i am going to discuss nothing in silence to god the almighty and universe just will put the node point on nothing this is our will be flow this is flow next addition will go toward from uh, universe towards something else now nothing nothing means no one generally nothing earlier used in the sense of countable noun only now we are using in both of the way countable and uncountable root is thinga root is thinga this root is proto germanic thinga means assembly earlier whenever uh, this nomadic people was there or uh, you can say uncivilized people were there there will be a standing assembly every every society small or small society will be there they will they will maintain there or they will do regularly as a standing assembly like one leader will be there they will look like okay 100 people are there then society everybody is there yes if nobody is there no thinga and their root word was there that was you can say very trivial language thinga thinga means you can say assembly if an assembly they came no person is there no thinga no the nothing means no one in assembly none not anything not something or we can just combine with other verb and we can make very beautiful application do nothing no nothing none nothing garian nothing